Hey, what's up there folks? Core here with Android Community and we just got the brand new Verizon powered Droid Incredible 4G LTE. This is uh, the HTC Droid Incredible and uh, we've heard plenty about it um, for a good couple of months here. It was announced in May, it was supposed to be coming soon and uh, it took a little while but eventually uh, today Verizon has officially announced that this will be available on July 5th for $149 after a little mail-in rebate and uh, we've already seen this a few times actually and done hands-on as well so today we're basically just going to kind of unbox it a little and uh, give you another additional rundown so paperwork start guide gibberish and then in this neat little box is a long extra long micro USB cord and the hefty charger pretty big charger there HTC gotta say anyways throw it aside this 4G LTE power device and get right to it here it is, the Verizon HTC Droid Incredible 4G LTE. And uh, what we have here is a decent little phone, um, a little bit more pocketable for those that don't want something large like the uh, HTC One X or uh, even the Galaxy S3 with that 4.8 inch screen. Instead, HTC opted for a 4.0 inch screen with a QHD uh, 540 by 960 resolution. And other than that, this phone is basically just like the HTC One S or One X. In terms of specs, we have Android 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich, HTC Sense UI 4.0, the three capacitive buttons down below, a powerful 8 megapixel camera on the rear, although this does not have the image chip that should help with you know photo taking like the other HTC One devices. But we do get 4G LTE, 1700 milliamp battery, and a decent overall package for the price. So as you can see, I already ran down the specs. You have the 8 megapixel camera. It looks a lot like the uh, ReSound. I've um, got a little speaker grill there, flash, and then that beats audio integration like expected from HTC. Right here is the micro USB charging port, microphone pinhole on the bottom, and then the volume rocker, pretty standard stuff. Then up top, power button, and the 3.5mm headphone jack. So, just a quick little uh, unboxing here. We've seen this, we've done hands on of the software. And everything will basically be almost identical, so there's not a lot you can uh, expect to see that's different. And then right here, micro SD slot for additional storage. As expected, it's kind of weird they have this little slot here that's that's hard and shiny, and the rest is a you know flat matte black. But let's get it back together and quickly boot it up. So you can see it. Get this phone booted up here. It looks like it was uh, a little dead. Battery's completely dead out of the box. Obviously, Verizon announced this a few months ago, and uh, we've been waiting or for an announcement for it to officially be available. It looks like it's been on the shelves for a little while. Battery was completely dead in there. Had to hold that power button down for quite a while. But here it is, the Droid Incredible 4G LTE, with the usual Droid look to it. We'll let it boot and finish. And it's got the you know the red accents everywhere with the top and the power button and the speaker grill and then same on the back with the uh, camera and the Beats Audio. So I mean it's followed along with everything we expected from uh, the Droid Incredible line as well as the HC One line. So it's a nice blend between the two. Good mid-size pocketable device. And I did mention mid-range before, but I wouldn't necessarily call it a mid-range phone. I mean it's got the same specs as the uh, the top tier. You know, Samsung Galaxy S3 and uh, HTC One S with that uh, dual core Qualcomm S4 Snapdragon processor. The only difference here is basically that, you know, it doesn't have an HD display and it's a slightly smaller screen. Um, but there it is. And uh, we're very familiar with HTC Sense, so this is actually nothing, you know, extremely new or anything we haven't seen before. So uh, not a lot here to go over. But uh, as you can see, I mean, the performance is swift and uh, stable with uh, that, that Qualcomm processor and Android 4.0 Ice Cream Sandwich. Uh, Verizon, now HTC did announce general, you know, comment that, you know, they're going to look forward to upgrading to Jelly Bean, which obviously we're going to have to wait a little while for that. But the only difference here is uh, the camera um, is not quite as good here compared to HTC One S or the One X. Um, it doesn't have that shutter where you can just go ahead and go into camera and just click away. You can't just hold it down and just click, 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 click like the others. But other than that, it's uh, just about everything we kind of expected and very similar so 
There is our quick look again at the all new HTC Droid Incredible 4G LTE. Available on the 5th for $1.99 with a little mail in rebate. Thanks for watching and stay tuned for our full review.